Well, welcome to the teens on tour at Dartmouth Golf and Country Club. Uh, we're just finished the third hole, the well, second hole. Uh, both got three points, and uh, this looks like it could be quite a hilly course. Uh, we're walking. Everybody else seems to be in buggies, so we'll see uh, what today brings. Looks like the course is in lovely condition. The uh, greens are playing a little bit slower than what we've been used to at Team Valley. But maybe to do with so they're still a bit damp. But uh, looks like we've got a nice... Everybody says why aren't you riding in the buggy? Uh, when you see slopes like this and valleys like this, you realise why. So uh, let's see how we get on. Well, this is a nice interesting par 3. 154 yards over the water, under the green. Uh, Chris has managed to put his fairly close to the pin, and mine's on the front edge. Uh, both quite pleased with that. Uh, let's see what we can do. I know Chris is looking the closer we get to it, the closer it seems to be the hole. So he could be on for a two here. We'll find out. That's uh, Chris teeing off on the f fifth, par three. Uh, playing a provisional, I think the first one went a bit right. You went a bit right. <laughs> <laughs> Number six, after another uphill climb, par four, 316 yards, into the wind. Just wait for the green, the green to clear, just in case I hit it in one. <laughs> no comment from Chris. Yards, yeah, yeah. <laughs> 790. I got 192 on my watch. Into the wind, uphill, for the very pretty waterfall. So, uh, see how Chris gets on with this one. Won the last hole. He parred it and I blobbed it. So, shouldn't have gone in the bunker. A shot just coming back into the middle of the fairway. Lovely jubbly. We've uh, just gone past the halfway stage. We're on the tenth now. Uh, Chris is four points in the lead at the moment. It might well change. You never know. Just about to drive off. No, it's just short of the bunker. Right, here's Graham ready to tee off. He's got a bomb on right at the fairway. It's a par four. Quite a long hole. It's a beautiful. And a great shot as well. Straight down the middle. What do we expect? Well, we've uh, reached the 12th hole. Uh, Chris is pulling further and further ahead after getting a spawny par on the last hole, having put one on the edge of the bunker, one in the trees. <laughs> Dunk the next one by hitting the trees again and then putting it in the hole. So, uh, no justice in the world. Well, it's been a tough old walk, but a lovely course. Next time I think we'll definitely have a buggy. But it's, uh, we've reached the 18th hole. And looks like it's quite a challenging hole with 195 to the centre, over water, bunkers all around. Uh, so there's the hotel, the cottages up on the hill. It's been an absolutely wonderful course, but uh, I'll let you know how we get on in a minute when we finish this one. 